in the summer and fall of 2019. We are underway now in the 2020 USL Championship season between St. Louis and Miami. St. Louis not being afraid to play that ball over the top diagonally and it's causing some problems for Miami. For a clearance effort and it's knocked away by Silvestre. Ciceroni has his second shot on target. The left side and this time it was a poor clearance effort and that's one that you've got to put. Morton took a shot. Trouble in the back. This is a giveaway and it's picked up by Greg and it's the first goal of the season. The man who was second in St. Louis FC history for single season. No, it's one of the rare, rarest calls, but it does happen. Let's see how they respond. Wharton pushes, see Cerrone, hammers it home. Kick. And once that ball rolled forward, ref had to make the call. And players like G and Laparay wide on the outside, we have to make sure that they're under pressure when they come up. Sadie has been a bright spot. Take a look at that. Sadie tripped in the box, penalty. But for Miami, this is what they want to see. We want to see Sadie going 1v1 on the outside. In the final stages of the first half, it's Romario Williams. It's the first goal in Miami FC championship history. Great technique. That's where you want to put it, side netting. Very difficult for the goalkeeper to get that one. Haven't been able to find the inroads just yet, but you said it. There's a confidence on the ball, and here's an opportunity. It's Bezicourt. He'll have a rip, and it's deflected by Morton. It falls for Williams, and Morton suctions it up. Passing in their movement. Granito playing the ball through, and there's Bezicourt just holding off his defender, getting a shot on goal. In comes Velasquez. Settle it down. It's a turnover. Velasquez coming the other way with help. He's got Williams to his right. Here's Romario Williams, and it's offline. That was a great chance for them to take advantage of. Romario Williams just pushing that ball wide right. Velasquez here picking out Williams. Williams side footing it. Finding Blackwood in space. This is where he's dangerous. Blackwood has made a run down the right side. Has he stayed onside? He's in on Silvestre. Blackwood 3 1. There he is. This is where his most dangerous 1v1 situations on the outside. Playing a 1 2, getting it behind the defense and picking his corner. St. Louis 3 to 1. Great ball in behind by Wharton and Sam. And here, here comes Wharton. But that was just a quick strike from St. Louis, from the man that just came on. Sadie got his cross in, and Williams nearly followed Morton's mistake with an answer. All into the box from Sadie. He's been a bright, bright spot. Meanwhile, for St. Louis, he's gonna move on. Here's a break, Blackwood. Looking into the middle, Rivas lays it off, and Ciceroni puts it home. Two for number nine, and it's a 4-1 route. Again, the sub Blackwood making an impact on the game, turning his man at the midfield line, pushing forward. Griffiths couldn't keep up with him, sending in a great cross across the ball. St. Louis FC goal delivered by Dominoes, served on a platter by Rivas. Don Freeman is going to look at his watch, and when he does, he'll blow the whistle for the end of the game. It's a 4-1 St. Louis victory. Turning into an emphatic one at that.